Hello everybody. My name is Andreas Huber from Instrument Systems. As sales and product manager, I am responsible for the DMS product line. Instrument Systems mission is to offer industry-leading optical measurement solutions. Near eye display testing and qualification for augmented and virtual reality headsets is becoming an application with increasing importance. Today, I'm excited to introduce a new solution which mimics the human eye even closer to reality to ensure the measurement is comparable to the actual user experience. In this webinar, I will first introduce our goniometric display measurement system, the DMS, with regard to ARVR applications. We will then see a real-time measurement of a AR device and I will give some explanations on the system's optics design. Finally, the measurement result, the eye box map, will be shown. The DMS-803 is a fully motorized 6-axis goniometer with microscope optics, a kes 140 d spectrometer and an optional fast photometer as second detector. For AR-VR applications, the system features all needed degrees of freedom to mimic the human visual system. The DMS also features various accessories for ambient light simulation as well as for temperature dependent tests. AR VR head mounted devices have multiple integrated components and features like the see through optics, the virtual image, and the image source as well as a number of sensors. With the DMS we can realize virtual image and see-through optics measurements. The measurement parameters are the so-called iBox or qualified viewing space which requires a system allowing for angular dependent tests in combination with a spectrometer. Flicker and response time is measured with a fast photometer. Here you see a typical head-mounted device as DOT on the DMS-803 rotational table. Above the DOT you can see the microscope with dedicated AR-VR optical system which mimics the human eye. The mechanical design of the system allows to measure under different eye relief distances by simply adjusting the C-axis. When starting the measurement, the XY linear table will position the DOT for measurement of the left eye side. The goniometer will move the DOT to all different phi azimut angles for each theta inclination angle. Important to highlight is the external aperture staying stationary in horizontal position, no matter at which theta inclination angle the microscope moves. Once the angular measurement on the left eye side is completed, the system automatically moves to the right eye side to repeat the angular scan. In this slide I am summarizing the features of the DMS AR VR optical system. The optics are designed to mimic the human pupil. The DMS mechanical setup allows to put the rotation axis in or behind the pupil. The concept is depicted in the image on the right side. The setup features collimating optics. The focus is set with external adaption optics either to infinity or to a defined distance depending on the position of the virtual image. The used entrance pupil is realized with exchangeable precision apertures, which are kept in stationary horizontal position. Typical aperture size is 3.6 mm, but different aperture sizes can be realized. The system features a defined field of view angle for example plus minus one degree. Different field of view angles 
can be realized. Here you are seeing another close-up of the scan, showing the aperture staying in stationary horizontal position. This mimics exactly what the human visual system is experiencing when looking at a virtual image through a head-mounted AR-VR device. The measurement data can now be plotted for the left and the right eye. Here we plotted the relative luminance. Since the measurements are done with a spectrometer, we can also analyze, for example, color or wavelength. Setting up the measurement for different eye relief distances requires just a few mouse clicks. The DMS features a set of comprehensive software tools, including GUIs to control and operate the system, configure the measurements and to analyze result data. Moreover, the system can also be controlled from externally with, for example, a script language like Python to realize customized measurements and applications. Thank you for watching this webinar. What is your AR-VR measurement challenge? Please contact us with your questions. Our sales and application engineers will be happy to answer you.